Uh, hello. Um, I just wanted to do a video on Buffy the Vampire Slayer because um, today I officially love the show. Like I'm a massive fan of it now. I think I I just quickly did a search and um, a few months ago I did a video to say that I'm starting to like it after the Inca Mummy Girl episode. Um, since then I've watched um, finished watch season two and started watching season three. And um, I'm at the start of episode 3 of season 3, which is um, Faith, Hope and Trick or something like that. That's the title. And I just started watching it, like, um, and, like, it was just so good. Like, the dialogue at the start is just so funny. Like, Willow was talking about how they're seniors and stuff. And funny bits with um, Xander's doing that coupling, uncoupling bit. You know, you won't understand what this is unless you've watched it. But it's just so funny. It's like, the dialogue... When I was watching, I was thinking the dialogue in this is as funny as a, a Seinfeld episode, and, and it's clever, and it's entertaining, and um, it's like wow, like compared to like my feelings of it when I first watched the show to now, it's like it's just gone, it's gone, ah, oh, it's like yeah, everyone says um, season three is like a really good season. A lot of people say it's their favorite season, and I'm loving it so far. So far, I mean it's. I would say it's my favourite season at the moment because season 2 started off really well like better than season 1 and now season 3 is better than season 2 Just it's just amazing Like um, it's like watching an NBA player who's come in you know, first season he's, he's, he's good, shows a lot of potential the second season he starts doing really good some flashes of brilliance and then third season he's like an all-star like he just... Um, starting to really get clicking the gear and kicking butt it's like that uh, so I just when I watch a sh episode of Buffy I just feel like running down and doing a status on Facebook saying how good this show is but I haven't done it because like otherwise I'll be doing every single episode but oh uh, it's just so funny like um, not so funny but just so awesome in every way like like yeah entertaining it's the dialogue's great the characters are really 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 good um like Buffy she's such a great hero like um and it's cool because she's not just like this perfect hero who has no flaw you know she um she always tries to help people but at the same time she's vulnerable like a normal human being as with her emotions like you know getting hurt and you know feeling left out or something or oh it's, it's incredible like I can't talk enough good things about it <laughs> uh, I really like this show a lot it's um just watching an episode it's like it always surprises me like what like it it doesn't just do the same thing again and again like every episode I'll be like oh my god it's coming up for me from this direction and next episode I'll be like doing something else you know it's incredible Joss Whedon it's like so amazing um yeah what, what else can I say about this show except that it's... I'm so glad I watched it. The only... The main reason I started watching it was because, um... I met, um... One of my friends, um... I made a friends with someone at this birthday party named Amanda. Um, and she, uh, had not... She was a buff... She was a Joss Whedon fan, but she had not watched Firefly. And I was like, oh, you gotta watch Firefly. It's awesome. And, um, she was telling me how good Buffy was. And, um, she recommended I watch it. So, she started watching Firefly and she loved it. And then um, I thought, it's only fair if I try and watch Buffy now. So I did, and um, everyone, you know, like I, I heard um, Cameron, my friend Cameron telling me, first season's okay, and then second season gets better, and then third season's awesome. So I remember that, and I know from a fact, for a fact that a lot of my favourite shows are like that. You know, the first season's not always not that great, but somehow if, you, if later on it just gets amazing and right now Buffy season 3 is at that point where it's just like every single scene I watch is like oh wow that's so cool um I guess because yeah I don't want to talk too much about anything except with you know because otherwise I don't want to spoil anything but just just some random things that I'm thinking of at the moment is like um Principal Snyder the principal at the school I really like his character he's so he's such a bastard but um so funny like you know he's so uh, and I, I find him very very funny and he's a good character um Cordelia is fantastic I really like her she's so funny the thing she says is fantastic um yeah I like more Buffy's really grown on me a lot 
like her character is really really great and her mum as well her mum is fantastic it's just like I could it's like such a believable mum as well and uh, I can't say enough good things about it um, Spike is really cool as well I find him very funny and apparently my friend Amanda just told me um, he gets more funny and adorable apparently from her point of view the more it goes on as well so I'm looking forward to that um, so I just want I'll probably end this video now but I just have to say that Buffy is um, yeah it's one of my favorite TV shows now like it's so good um, it's fantastic great